looking deep, and it is caught. Got snap to Andrew Ford, who's looking deep, down the middle. Down inside the 10, now the five, and in. It's gone by so fast, um, you know, I know I was a freshman at Virginia Tech, some of those kids were saying, you know, enjoy it. It's, it's going to be gone in a blink of an eye, and my path is definitely not what I expected it to be, but it's still flown by. Um, so I'm um, just trying to soak it all in, have some fun with it, um, but understand that, you know, we have a lot of business to take care of on the field this year. Andrew didn't get here till uh, the summer, so um, he didn't have spring practice, and you know, Ross had been in the system a couple of years, and he just got better and better. I just think there's no greater teacher than, than experience, and once Andrew started playing, he understood our schemes and understood the defense. I probably put a little bit too much on his plate early, but, you know, one of the early games with Mississippi State, we made some great plays, and then, you know, you know they've got some speed um, in the SEC, and I, I think it showed up a little bit more against South Carolina, how much better he got. And then the last game against Hawaii, you know, we threw, you know, four touchdowns and no interception. I think he had three touchdowns against Troy. So as it went into it, he just uh, – we got a little bit better of a um, feel for one another and the things that he liked, and we groomed a little bit of the system around him, and, uh, you know, he just, he's taken off since then. Ford throws one to the end zone. Isabella reaches up in the corner, makes the catch. He's got the touchdown, two feet in bounds. The, the first year here, it wasn't really him changing the offense because I'm left-handed. It was him tweaking some things to stuff that I did better, stuff that I liked more. So our offense hasn't changed because I'm left-handed. I just think it's stuff that I like you know, a little bit better. It's the snap, bootleg left, throws it into the flat. It's caught by Lee, the fullback. He's prepared, and that, that gets some uh, automatic respect from the, the rest of the team, the rest of the offense. and. Uh, you know, and then, then um, he's made the plays. He made the plays in big games and uh, uh, can throw the deep ball. He's got a strong arm, uh, maybe a little stronger than it looks when you're a left-hander, but uh, really good touch I and mean, just a, a great command. So uh, just been a blast to coach for uh, all of us, especially myself. We have guys all over the field that are capable of making big-time plays. So for me, it makes my job easy because, you know, defenses can't game plan to shut down one guy. Um, you know, a lot of guys are going to be focused on Andy Isabella, but I think that opens up opportunities for guys like Sadiq Palmer and Brennan Dingle and Jesse Britt. And then you, know, you try and take the pass away, and then we, you know, we have backs like Bilal and Marquise that, you know, that, that can break it any, at each and every single play. So for me, it makes my job easy. You just got to you know, get the ball off quick and let them make plays. So um, you know, it, I'm excited. I know Coach Football has been chomping at the bit to put some of this new stuff in. I think if you ask every single guy in that locker room, our goal would be to win a bowl game. I think that we're very set on that, and that's important to have everybody working towards the same goal. But for me personally, you know, I'm just really trying to, to better myself each and every single day on and off the field, bring these young guys, you know, up to speed uh, that just got here. And some of the younger guys that have played before, take them to that next level and really, you know, expand, you know, their football knowledge, but also how to, you know, handle yourself off the field um, with the success that comes with it. So for me, you know, I, it's obviously very important what, what I do for these younger guys on the field, but I'm also looking forward to help them grow off the field as well.